is my Spotify car thing that I paid way too much money for, but they're going to brick it December 9th and it will no longer work as a Spotify car thing. But I'm going to root it and show you guys how you can make this a desk thing so you can actually use it in the future. Depending if you have Windows or Mac, it will change on what you need to download or do. So the video I would check out is the desk thing YouTube to show you how to hack. This is called hacking your Spotify car thing, any platform setup part one published November 19th, 2024 by the desk thing YouTube channel. Go check out that YouTube video. I'll link it in my description, but I think this is the best way to teach you how to do everything and as all the install links. Okay. I'm actively flashing my car thing. You can see it's loading up. The new OS. Let's watch it finish together. It says it's done. That's good. Okay. Let's check out the car thing now. My computer up here. Okay. Now apparently all you just need to unplug it and plug it back in. Oh yes. Thing labs. That's good. That's what I flashed on there. Let's go. So Thing Labs is booting up. Oh, Spotify's up now. Okay, I just have this plugged into an external anchor battery and it works as expected. So let's go through this setup for the first time together. All right. From here, you can just pair your uh, Spotify car thing like normal. So if you hit this right button, phone connection, add new phone, pairing mode, pair. The next step is to go to deskthing.app, which is a website, and download your particular um, OS. So I'm on Windows, I'm gonna download Windows and pull that up in downloads. And I'm going to open that. Run anyways, YOLO. I'm going to click find ACV devices. So you want to click on downloads and then download latest for desk thing client. And once that down is downloaded, you can then click on clients and your car thing should pop up. Mine's connected over here. And so I'm going to click reconnect device. I heard a noise in my headphones. It's doing something. So I had to restart my computer, unplug my Spotify car thing, turn on the Spotify car app running on Windows, then plug it back in again. And then I could hit connect here in the app. And it looks like I'm in business now and I can start playing around with the desk thing app. Okay. The most confusing part about this is when you click on apps and you download the Spotify app, it'll say requested and you need to click on that and then go through a number of Spotify authentication steps for developers. This is really quite convoluted and the desk thing app is super buggy. So, after I did the authentication thing for Spotify dev, it's just been in a boot loop stuck in the desk thing. I don't know if I should kill it. Hitting reconnect and the app doesn't work. I'm going to unplug it. YOLO. Okay. I rebooted again. Let's see if it'll change a song. Ooh, it worked. Let's go. Nice. Nice. It's working. Okay. So if you're having problems with this, just unplug it and replug it in and that'll fix it. Obviously it has some bugs, but they're working on it. So here on my computer, you can click on client. You can see it's running and the app Spotify app is running which is connected to my computer. Okay, desk thing is a good attempt and it's a good idea, but there's so many errors 
And if you are non-technical, I would not attempt this. Okay, after I did install the Dust Thing app onto my car thing, the cleanest install I've had is booting up fresh from start. I have the Dust Thing plugged in and I turn on my computer and then I turn on the Dust Thing app. And then the Dust Thing app, desktop app will not pull up. So you need to go into the bottom right corner of your Windows computer, click open server on the desk thing server and then it will pull up and your car thing should be connected because it was already connected when you plugged it in when you turn on the computer and the desk thing app the Spotify app should be auto started after you turn it on for the first time so after you set everything up for the first time it will work pretty clean I will admit the first time I tried to set this up it, it was very buggy and it just wasn't working as expected just let it sit for a few days come back to it, then you'll know how to use it after you've played around with it for a while. It is, it is a little bit frustrating the first time you go through it, but it does work as expected the next time you do plug it in and go through the steps of turning it on in the expected order. So thank you to the Dust Thing developers for making this and putting this out for us to use. I do like having it connected to my desktop app and I do like seeing the Spotify art as I'm playing songs and having a little remote to tap versus just having the Spotify app open in my computer. Anyways, I hope this was helpful. I would check out the Desk Thing YouTube channel. They have some good videos on install, but they're still working on videos on like how to really set this up and connect it to your computer. Thank you for watching and please like and subscribe to my channel. Chunky Audio. Thanks for watching, y'all.